Here is my social media. Check out my Roblox group and merch. Hey everyone, Ashley Bunny here, and today we are going to be playing on Roblox Royal High, and we have some more tea. And guys, <laughs> I know, I haven't made a video since like September 10th, which is like <laughs> more than 16 days ago. But you know, in the grand scheme of things, 16 days isn't really a long time. And yeah, I was just a little bit more focused on school, like I said. Um, I'm gonna be, you know, posting a little bit more sporadically. But I will be trying to post like more and more as the year goes on. So some of the tea that I'm gonna be saying in this video um, is probably, I don't know if it's gonna be old, cause you know, 16 days isn't really old. But then again, Royal High like updates and tea, it moves really fast sometimes. So if you see some pieces of tea that you've seen already, like if you've seen some old tea, just like, I don't know, it's not for you, it's for the people that have not seen this update or this tea. So yeah, that is for those people who haven't seen it yet. And by the way guys, I literally don't watch any other Royal High YouTuber like tea channels, so I don't know if like, you've already seen this tea or if it's already been put into a video. But hey, I'm gonna put it into my video, so if you haven't seen it, you can see it by me. So the first tweet is by Sticks and Tricks. Of course, Sticks and Tricks is so good with this whole Royal High Tea thing. So this tweet says, Lance just said, Barbie will consider a candy home store hunt, but it's more down to the home stores themselves to do it. Okay, so this screenshot that I took was on September 10th at 6 p.m. And I just saw a tweet, I think it was two days, two or three days ago. And I think it was confirmed that candy stores or candy home stores are probably not coming back this Halloween. Lance actually said it on stream. It's like probably not going to come back. It's not like high on their list of priorities right now. If it's even on that list. So yeah, don't get your hopes up for that. And then next we have like some awesome hair from Sweet and Bones on Twitter. And this post says, Retro Cadillac, hair by me. 20s inspired, customizable hair scarf and alligator clips. Made for Royal High. Thank y'all for the appreciation on the past two posts. Thread for more. So I didn't take all the photos from the thread because there were so many and it was just like the same angles but just different colors, you know? So I'm gonna show a few angles of the hair and you guys are gonna see why I'm showing this right now because it may seem like a concept but you'll see why I'm showing it in this tea video. So this first screenshot is of course of the 20s inspired hair. Very cute, like I really love um, like vintage things. So I'm really glad that someone actually made this. So this hair is in blonde and next we actually see the hair with the alligator clips and the scarf. So this is really cool, like can you guys say wow? This reminds me, like whenever I see like really cool concepts like this, it reminds me of when I'm just scrolling through dozens and thousands of sims 4 cc and the next screenshot is of the same hair uh, but it's like a close-up of the alligator clips and there's no scarf and so those are the three photos that i chose to pick out of the bunch that was posted the whole reason i'm showing this is because a is for royal high and b because of this tweet from night barbie she said wow your creations are absolutely gorgeous i'm so sorry i didn't see this earlier i've been inactive on twitter but ready the teddy links me to your creations. I'd love to hire you slash purchase your hair if you are down. What is the range of the trees in your hairstyles? Uh, is it trees or tris? So yeah, the whole reason I showed that post is because Barbie is seriously contemplating adding it to the game. And she literally said I'd love to hire you slash purchase your hair. Because clearly we don't know like if they've DM'd each other, but you know, I'm guessing that they're, you know, working in cohorts, you know. The next tweet is from Johnny Soleil. And Johnny says, I have two things planned for Royal High Halloween this year. Not gonna spoil it. But besides that, I also want to work on some Halloween slash fall accessories for boys. Like stereotypical guy stuff. I wouldn't know anything about that, LMAO. Do you all have any ideas? So I did look in the thread and there were some really cool ideas. But of course I'm not going to show it in this video because I don't know if they're actually going to come into game. They're just ideas that may or may not be put into action. So the next tweet is also from Johnny, and it says, The Halo of Maleficent. Oh dear, what an awkward situation. Hashtag Royal High Villain Halos. So here's the first picture of this really cute halo. This is so detailed, and it's really scary to be honest. <laughs> like the teeth on the dragon on Maleficent is just over the top crazy, and I'm in love with it. Like this looks so cool. I'm just going to leave it on the screen for you to soak up the beauty in it. Anyway, so the next tweet is from 
Flixie. Is that am I saying that right? Flixie on Twitter. And this person said, here's a Halloween themed wheel I made for the Halloween update. So this isn't too much tea, but it's like, it's an idea, you know? And I kind of want to throw it in. So this wheel is like really cool and I really hope it comes into game because I don't think we've ever had like a Halloween themed wheel. Please correct me if I'm wrong. What would be cool is like if we had a different wheel every time a new season came around. So the next tweet is from Matt Crystal 3 and it says, nothing actually it just shows a photo of this and it's not even a full photo it's just like a photo of like a piece of a dress or a skirt or something and then sebi says mad omg i'm gonna scream if this is a set for sale i'm paying 5k robux literally my same energy and then matt says i mean it is for royal high so that was what really got me excited. I was like, oh my goodness, like, are you kidding me? So I took the screenshot on September 14th. So that was only a few short days ago, like 10, nine days ago. And then Matt posts this, little symbol bakery sweetheart set made live on Twitch. Took three hours and it's okay, I mean, not great. I need to practice more, surely. I mean, I strongly disagree. This is very cute. Like this is amazing. And in only three hours, that's something. And I'm gonna go ahead and show the photos right now. So here is a photo of it from the back, very cute. Then we have a photo from the front, like kind of at a side angle. And then lastly, we have a photo like straight on from the front, just head on. And then we also have another photo and it's in different lighting. I think it's actually rendered, but oh my gosh, please let me have this set. It's giving me very much strawberry shortcake and I'm very in love with that, so. I really hope we get this like in the new update or just soon in general. Next we have a tweet from Royal High Updates and the tweet says, there will be Royal High mini games coming where you can earn XP plus prizes from them. There will also be a leaderboard alongside high scores. Oh, alongside high scores. I think they're talking about the Halloween update, I'm pretty sure. Next we have a tweet from Miku on Twitter and Miku says, Bible pixies and etc. And there's photos of literal Bible pixies, like purchasable pixies. I don't know whose stream this was in. Correct me if I'm wrong, I think it was Jam Jam Ju's stream. I think so. I'm really not completely sure. But yeah, I'm just gonna put the photos on the screen. You guys can clearly see for yourselves. There's Light Fairy for 5,000 diamonds, Dark Fairy for 5,000 diamonds. I think these are like mini kind of pets, you know, like that follow you around. I'm not sure though. And lastly for today, we have a tweet from David. And this tweet says, check out this spooky new Halloween lobby for Battle a la Royale for the upcoming Royal High update. In case you guys haven't seen my most recent tea spills on my tea spill videos, David is actually a part of the Royal High building team. So he is building stuff for Royal High as we speak, you know? So let's go ahead and get excited for that. So I included four photos. So the first photo is, guys, this is the new lobby for Battle a la Royale. Guys, would you look at this lobby? This is the first photo. And I cannot believe that we're gonna be standing in this. Like, I can't believe that this is actually real. This is so cute. The next photo is from like the back of the room, you know? I'm pretty sure this is the back of the room. It looks like we have pumpkin clocks or I think they're, oh no, no, they're pumpkin target boards. I'm pretty sure you can shoot in the lobby. Like I'm pretty sure you can. I think that's why those are there. The next screenshot is just like a close up of everything. Ooh, on the far right, you can see bows on the wall. Okay. And I love all the chandeliers going on here. This looks like a mini spooky haunted house. And the very last screenshot is just like a wide angle shot of um, the front of the room. Yeah, it's got to be the front of the room because there's nothing else in front of us but like the fireplace and stuff. So yeah, this is from the front of the room. I'm guessing as soon as you spawn in, you will see this. Just soak up all the beautiful Halloween vibes in this because it's bigger than the lobby we have now, like such a huge upgrade. It's such like a spacious area. So I'm glad we have that. And yeah, that's all the tea I have for you guys today. Well, I could have added more tea, but I feel like I don't want to drag on this video too long, you know? And it is Saturday, so I'm taking advantage of my day off from school or my days off from school because I'm probably going to try to upload tomorrow. Anyways, that's all the tea I'm going to share for you guys for this time. I have so much more tea saved. Like, oh my gosh, guys. 
I'm going to try to pump out as many tea videos as I can because I want to keep you guys updated with all the tea that's going about. And also, I'm going to try to put a clip in here. Thank you guys, whoever came to my um, mini meet and greet because I was one of the featured creators in the Royal High Autumn Festival and so many of you guys came and oh my gosh guys it was so overwhelming it was so scary like i love meeting you guys but it was so scary there was so many people and i think i was online for three hours two and a half and i like my back was hurting because i was sitting there for so long i was so hungry because like i wanted to get up and go get something to eat but i wanted to get photos with you guys first and so i'm sorry if i didn't get to you because i literally like I was like at my limit like I couldn't sit on the computer anymore because I think that day I'd already been in school for like seven plus hours on the computer and so that's like almost 10 hours in total straight sitting on the computer and I couldn't get up um, for school and I also didn't want to get up because I didn't want to you know leave the meet while you guys were still waiting for photos. I am going to try to set up more meet and greets soon. Because Meet and Greet Realms, they never actually got a testing phase, I don't think so. We never got to test them, and plus I don't have a badge. So <laughs> hopefully I can get a badge, or hopefully applications open before Meet and Greets are available, like the Meet and Greet Realms and stuff. Hashtag bunny needs a badge. <laughs> but anyways guys, thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoyed, please make sure to hop on that like button and comment down below, and subscribe to become a bunny and to join the Bunny Garden. This has been your girl Ashley Bunny here, bye, moi.